sign of bipartisanship, Governor Glenn Youngkin has signed a bill into law that he says will help Virginia's colleges and universities compete in college athletics. It all has to do with how student athletes are allowed to make money off their name, image and likeness. Capitol VR reporter Tyler Englander joins us live from the Capitol. Tyler, what does this bill do? Well, Eric Deanna, this new law would allow colleges and universities in Virginia to help facilitate deals between companies and student athletes for the use of their name, image or likeness. Tonight, with the help of some friends, Governor Glenn Youngkin signing a bill into law that he says will allow Virginia's college sports teams to be more competitive. Right now, there's just so much competition, conference realignment, NIL, transfer portal. This is a feather in our cap, and we can put our best foot forward. Youngkin signing House Bill 1505, giving Virginia's colleges and universities more involvement in how student athletes can be compensated for the use of their name, image, or likeness. If this is an opportunity for them to be able to improve their quality of life and the quality of lives of, of their families, then, then I'm all for it. The new law allows colleges and universities in Virginia to help negotiate deals with companies and even pay college athletes for the use of their name, image, or likeness, something the NCAA currently doesn't allow. I don't want anybody to come to the University of Virginia just because of NIL, uh, but it's important to be able to, to, to speak openly and honestly in that space. And, and for us, you know, we, we wanted to be a part of the package. The new law would also make it illegal for the NCAA to prohibit schools in Virginia from being more involved in the process, something Youngkin says is critical. You have a 18 or 19 year old that finds themselves on the other end of a very complicated contractual discussion. They need some help and uh, this allows the universities to in fact provide that help, which is really important. Now, Eric Dieta, this new law will take effect on July 1st. Live at the State Capitol, Tyler Englander, 8 News.